Hi everyone, it's Evangeline here at eTrailer and today we have our Ericsson 800 pound aluminum truck bed rack. This is going to be a ladder rack that we'll take a look at how it fits as well as how it installs on the 2023 Chevrolet Colorado. This is going to be an affordable way to expand the cargo capacity of your truck in terms of not just carrying things on the truck bed, but you can also carry things above the truck bed with this ladder rack. This is designed especially for cargo. So if you need to carry around lumber or ladders or Christmas trees, this is going to be the one for you. If you're looking for something that's more sports and rec like bike racks or roof boxes, because it's a more affordable option, you don't have those premium features that make this more versatile for those types of applications. So not gonna be the best fit for that. Now this is made of aluminum, which means that it will stand up to the elements. You can leave it out and you're not as worried about rust and corrosion and things like that. And this also includes the load stops here on this ladder rack. And that way, if you wanna carry around ladders, then this is designed specifically to make that experience better for you. This ladder rack system sits 29 inches tall. So that's the measurement from top of our truck bed to the top of the crossbar. Now, measuring for the top of our cab, I have it at 12 inches to the top of the crossbar. And that measurement can be helpful for maybe you have something on your roof rack, or maybe you have something on the ladder rack and it's sticking forward that way. You wanna make sure that you have enough clearance so you're not scratching up your roof. Crossbar spread is the measurement from the center of one crossbar to the center of the other one. I currently have it set to 32 inches apart, which is on the further end for most recreational accessories. But if you're using this to carry cargo, then usually you wanna play around with what works best and you want this further apart. So the maximum crossbar spread you're gonna be able to get with this is gonna be up to 42 inches apart. And that's mainly because of how your bed is shaped. And that's gonna be the maximum distance those clamps will be able to fit. Overall, very simple, straightforward ladder rack. Great for carrying around cargo, especially with that 800 pound weight capacity, but being made of aluminum, still a lightweight ladder rack. This is gonna be very easy to store inside a garage or keep on your truck. Now it has its downsides too. And the main thing is with it being a more affordable contractor rack, you don't have the features you would expect for a premium one, like adjustable height struts. So this is gonna be the height you're gonna have it on your truck, no ups or downs. And the crossbars don't have any tracks on the inside either. So if you need to strap anything around the bars, you need to double check the dimensions on our site to make sure it can fit. But for something that just gets the job done and does it well, but also easily, then this is gonna be a great rack for you. Now, we keep talking about how easy it is to get set up. Let's go take a look at that process. Getting your ladder rack set up on your truck is very simple, especially after you set it up the first time because then you can keep everything together and installed. Now, you do have a hardware kit included with this, but you do not have the tools included. So what you're gonna need is a Phillips head screwdriver as well as a 3 quarter and 11 16 wrench. If you're using sockets, try to get your deep sockets for your hardware. Now let's get started with the crossbar. Take the end cap off of your crossbar. You may need to use your Phillips head screwdriver for this one. With the end cap off, you're then able to slide your two bolts for each side of the crossbar, as well as install your two load stops per crossbar. So as you set up your towers, you do have to be mindful of what are you gonna be carrying with this ladder rack? Because specific baskets and boxes and accessories require a very specific crossbar spread. So you wanna be mindful of that. But also with your Colorado, with it being a smaller bed, you may want this a bit further apart to take advantage of that space. So wherever you decide to put your tower, just get that in place and make sure the other one is gonna fit in the same area. And you also wanna feel underneath. Since your Colorado does have little tabs underneath those rails, you're gonna try to get it where your clamps sit away from those tabs and have an even surface to cling to. Fit the clamp into the tower, making sure that the flat part sits in your rail. You're then going to put a flat washer and then a split washer 
and then a nut. With both clamps in place, I personally just hand tighten them down first and I don't use a wrench just yet because I like to verify that the crossbar sits flush on the towers. If it's not lined up, then it won't. So this gives me a little bit of wiggle room, but I'm not concerned about it falling off. Get your crossbar over your tower, line them up with the cutouts on both sides. Strap this in and see if we need to make any adjustments. That sits flush there and it sits flush on the other side. So now is a good time to tighten down all that hardware. So the crossbar bolts will have a flat washer and split washer and nut for each of them. And then those tighten down with an 11 16 wrench. Now for the tower bolts though, those are going to use a three quarter inch wrench to tighten those down. So secure all the hardware and you'll know that it's secure once your split washers flatten out. Once you've tightened down all your bolts, double check that everything is secure. Give it a good shake for good measure. Then that's it for your installation. Very simple to do. And when you take this off, you can keep everything together and just store it in your garage as is to make it even faster. This right here was a look at as well as an installation of the Ericsson 800 pound aluminum ladder rack and you saw it on a 2023 Chevrolet Colorado.